Hi everybody, a little experiment today. I'm off for a ride out and I'm meeting with one of my viewers uh, who lives uh, not far away from me. So I thought I'd give the uh, VFR a real life fuel challenge. Just to see what I can get. Not till it runs out, just until it gets to that last digit on the uh, fuel gauge which starts flashing. So I don't know if you can see that, I've actually filled the tank right to the top. It's brimmed there, don't often do that. And I've set my trip to zero miles. So I'm going to see how far I can get before that that last digit starts flashing. When that flashes I normally get a reading that says I've got about 30 miles, 40 odd kilometres left and about 3.2 litres usually. So it's going to be a good mix of riding. The temperature is about 11-12 degrees, not too breezy. I've got my top box on. I, As I say I weigh 75 kilograms. I've got a little bit less pressure than recommending my tyres. I do like to play around a little bit. So I'll do a, a little video when I stop to fill up and we'll see what it's done on a full tank to the reserve if you like. See you in a bit. So I've done uh, my run and the light has started flashing so let's have a look see where we are. So there we go we've got 155.5 can you see that bit of light reflecting 155.5 there's my flashing light it's been on about three miles so I'd say about 152 it says I've got 3.1 liters left I've averaged 9.9 .9 miles per liter So, 150 miles before the light comes on. Remember, I did a video on whether the 2012 models actually has a larger tank. I'll put a link to that in the description. But that's a fair bit of mixed riding there. Some fast, some steady way, a little bit of dual carriageway, maybe about 30, 40 miles of dual carriageway. Not much town work though. So, all around, not bad range really, you know, considering some of the horror stories that you get. But obviously that's just one day. It is on E10 fuel which isn't supposed to be as fuel efficient. So yeah take from that what you will. 150 miles before the light comes on. That's probably about what I would expect from the VFR 1200 in mixed running. Thanks for watching. Bye.